Welcome back guys to a new Boom Beach video and we are back from our little holiday with family there so let's get back into it daily wash-ups here. So what we have done is we have went into the next engine room so this was our uh, previous engine room base and base design there and here it is the last engine room of warships right there okay so we have just uh went into it we haven't done any attacks so far but i'll just show you what i have been um unlocking these last few days since we haven't really done any videos there so last video i made i think was of the troop damage i unlocked that so i went ahead gone over here gbe right there and of course the building health try to get that first and then we went down here, we we took the negative shock launcher, minus one there. It wasn't too bad there uh, because we were going to get, uh, pick up the two, the, two, the two shock launchers over here. So that sort of counteracts the minus one right there. And uh, we went over here building damage over the troop health because we really do need more damage since we have unlocked the rockets right there. Over here, we picked, of course, more troop damage to take out the buildings faster. Over here, we picked the Doom Cannon to try and take out the Heavy Choppers there. I could have also picked the Blaster, but I thought with the Doom Cannon, maybe it can, you know, do a couple of shots and uh, take out those darn Heavy Choppers there. So we picked that over there, and now here we are. We've grabbed this end room there. And what I want to do is go all the way over here and grab the Troop Damage. I think that might be the last node that... Uh, could possibly propel us into rank uh, 23. We haven't reached rank, rank 23 just yet. Uh, in terms of anything else, guys, uh, this one will go back once we have excess keys and we've unlocked the troop damage first. But other than that, I think we've pretty much unlocked pr um, everything that we need to. Um, we'll hold off on the heavies here. I think what I might do instead is grab the bombardier one over here somewhere. So this is a multi-node. We might pick the flame towards there. Uh, this is just at the end of the season, guys, tomorrow once we have... Uh, spare keys left over and this one is a bombardier boost so we want to try and get those boosted up a bit more uh, for the damage right there but let's hop right into it there let's see what we can do over here we've got three chests to collect and we have fallen down the highest we reached i think was 22 and um 50 stars if we can take if we can check over here on our profile we are still local five so that's pretty decent and the highest we reached this season was 22 and 38 stars okay so we aren't too far off right there, but we did fall down a tiny bit there, just trying to maintain um, rank 22 for now. So let's see if we can do a couple of these attacks, grab some chests and see what we can do. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to unlock the troop damage in this video because it's going to take, uh, what is it, two, four, six attacks there. That's going to be quite a long video there, but we'll try and see what we can do here. Okay, so this one is, let's see. We've got two heavy choppers here, so let's make the best use of it. I think we got to uh, drop them down. We will drop them down over here. We'll drop three on this side. We'll let them take out this mortar and we'll uh, try and build up some heavies since we're only using one heavy chopper on each side over here. Drop down Kavan with these guys. And I want these guys to go up the middle and then we want our last set of troops over here to go... Um, on the far right hand side over here let's try and take out some of these boom mines right there and now let's drop down those guys over there and i'm hoping that by the time we finish this uh, center area we should have a decent amount of heavies uh, built up now did we lose one yeah we did lose one bombardier so let's try and bring them back there can we and yeah we did we brought back some riflemen too but that shouldn't be too bad here okay now we're starting to come back heavy chopper oh dear okay I see the plan now of this base to kill our heavy choppers. Okay, so that's fine. Uh, let's see. No, we definitely don't want these guys to go over there, guys. Um, I think we're going to be coming around instead, actually. So I don't want to split up my troops here because we don't have any coverage on this side. So we'll just come all the way around here. It'll take us longer, but at least we'll have um, all our troops together. Heavies will be out in front and we should be able to be in a good position over here. So going around the base, we are going to lose perhaps about, I'd say about 10 seconds here. Uh, just going around. Come on, guys. These guys are still going back down there. So we're coming in there from the top. I haven't seen this base design at all, guys. So this must be a pretty good base design, actually. Um, let's go over here. Quitters over here. And let's start doing our second wins. We definitely need some more heavies now that we have lost all of our heavy choppers here. Let's do a shock on the crew launcher. That's going to be 
something will definitely need to slow down here. I have seen some people use uh, mechs as well at this point to shock the buildings and that's that's definitely a good idea. Let's go over here, do another second wind. I'll do a critters over here, but we are starting to be a bit low on GB to be honest. Uh, my, let me just use it on second wind instead actually. That's a little bit safer here. Okay, so we're powering through. I think we might need to do a few more shocks here. I'm not sure how much uh, tr defensive building damage he has. But it must be quite a lot because our heavies are sort of dropping like flies over here. Come on, we just need a few more seconds. He's got, he's still got a couple of cannons left up, guys. We got a shock here, so let's um, shock the shock launcher. And we'll throw down a uh, critters over there since there isn't any splash damage anymore. We can't flare the last engine just yet. He has already taken us out, though. So it doesn't really matter there. So let's go ahead, just grab this one. Shock right there, and yeah. So at least we uh, fully cleared that base. So definitely a new base design. I did not expect that there. Uh, kind of threw us off there. We lost our heavy chopper there too. So let's take a look. He got woman is 57. Okay, not a great time there, but I'm not sure what times will be great here. And that is it. So we were kicked out of rank 22 there. Let's try and get back up. Can we unlock? Yeah, we should be able to unlock stuff actually. So we should have actually been unlocking this in the first place. Over here, um, boom cannon, we're going to get one of that. Mortar, we're going to get two of that. I'm going to go with the cyber tower just because we're going to get three of those. And I just want more defenses for the opponent to uh, go through. And we were able to unlock this all along. Let's just grab this. Max it out there. And what I might do now is go for that troop health. Definitely want their heavies to survive a tiny bit longer there. Three sniper towers not going to make a world of difference there, but at least it will be um, a couple of more seconds for them to take out these defenses right there. So as you can see, the base isn't exactly that great, guys. Um, I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure what attack strategy he did there, but was it Seekers? Let's take a look. Uh, no, it was Heavies and uh, Bombardiers there. Okay, so that's fine. Let's see. He flared over there, yeah. That's definitely the right, right way to attack these types of bases, is definitely to flare over to one side and sort of split them up from there. And these guys went up the middle, I'm guessing, or did he delay drop another one there? He's got one bomb there over there. What's going to happen? And he just came all the, all the way around, I guess. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see what he did there. He was able to have bombardiers uh, shooting across the gap there. So I'm not sure where to put these guys where they're forced to come through the middle um let's see so i might put one yeah somewhere in here might be a good idea actually let's do that because i don't want them to be able to i want to force them to come into into the middle here there it is guys so that should help let's put the hotpot over here and now they should at least be forced to drop down a couple of bomb deers and force them to go down this choke point right there so hopefully that'll go well a little bit of uh, base updating as we see the replays always very important of course uh, let's see what's going to happen here so i'm going to drop one and three bombardiers with kavan we'll just shoot them up here this is the way to destroy these types of bases here so he's got a boom uh, boom cannon right there i'm not sure how much damage he has but it shouldn't be enough to take it take it out there let's see how much damage it does yeah not too bad there so i don't think we need to uh, shock We'll let them work up there and meanwhile let's drop these guys down here might even be able to let's drop them there we'll drop critters over there so that the mortars don't target the bombardiers too much those guys should be fine i'm going to do our first second wind right there and also uh, take out some of those boom mines right there okay if those bombardiers can go up to that mortar i'd be super chuffed there uh trying to get a three-way split right there shock over there Take out the shock mines over there. Come on, guys. Let's do a second win once again. What do we have over here? Let's do quitters down here. And I think... Can we save that one bomb deer? No, we can't. Unfortunately, he got picked off by the Simo there. So let's shock the critter launcher over there. And we are looking good in the center here. Let's just do a med kit right there from the rockets. Okay, that's fine. Now let's just beef up our front line. Um, is there is it worth trying to barrage out the sky shield there? We're sure we're at the end game here, but he doesn't seem to have too much building health there. Let's do one more right now. 
And let's flare on to the career launchers right now. We should be able to get ready. We're going to flare onto this engine right now. And come on, guys, where's the flare? That flare did not go down. I don't care about the shock launcher or the shock blaster here since we have plenty of troops in the front line. Let's do a shock over here. Two minutes, four seconds. Come on. Let's do critters over there. And one minute. We're still getting a one minute time there, guys. So one minute is 56 right there. Um, he's still on two, which is a good sign. But let's take a look at the time, though. And he's at two minutes. Okay. Looking a bit dicey here, to be honest. And come on, one minute is 59, 58, 57, 56 right there. Okay. Just about grabbed the win there, guys. Critter launcher coming in clutch. And, of course, that shock launcher hidden in the corner there. And is he reflaring? He doesn't. I don't think he has enough GB for that reflare there, guys. So he has to naturally let them uh, take out the defenses and grab that engine there. So that was a um, decent win, much needed, and that'll bring us right back up to rank 22 here. We seem to be going back and forth here. I'm not even sure if we're going to be able to reach uh, rank 23 this season, but at least we're going to start around rank 12 um, next season. So let's go ahead. We'll just do one more here. I'm not sure what we're going to unlock. We might unlock the... No, let's grab the troop health. That seems to be most important right now. Okay, and let's hop right back into it. Our last attack for today. Hopefully the troop health is what we need. It's definitely going to help us to last longer, especially the bombardiers too, against rocket launcher damage, but... We'll see what happens here. Fingers crossed we can eventually make it into rank 23. I don't think it's been um, it's been very long since we have reached rank 23 also, to be honest. I think we might have reached rank 23 maybe like once or twice, to be honest, um, in the early days of warships there. But right now we are on a, a good look here. We reached the end of the tech tree. We've managed to unlock all the engines and we might even be able to unlock the entire tech tree here in a second. Uh, in the next 24 hours so let's go ahead let's see what he's got over here what i want to do in these types of bases i have faced them before and let's see let's try and keep our troops together here since we are only using two heavy choppers um let's see the issue is he's got rockets on both sides you can see over here he's got a rocket over there and he's got a rocket over there so matter so no matter which side we pick <laughs> we're always going to be hit from the side and the bombardiers are okay so we're going through a choke point that's fine we're going to be facing what is it two shock launchers there some critter launchers some rocket launcher damage too but so long as our troops are together let's go let's shock right there first shock of of the match there let's do a second wind i'm not i can't even see kavan there he might die he might not let's do critters up there some distractions, some more shocks on that crew launcher, and let's do a second win on Kavan. He is low on health there. I can see him right there, guys. He's very, very low on health. We need to do a second win right now. Kavan, um, let's do a shock on that crew launcher. Can we save up for a second win? We've lost both of our um, heavy choppers here. Kavan, come on, stay alive, mate. We need second win desperately. We need that crew launcher to go down as well. Come on. Okay, wow. So we really did actually fizzle right there. So we're not going to be able to do anything else here. Can we grab one one more end room? Let's do some mech kits over here. We might be able to out heal these rockets. No. Wow. So next time I face these types of bases, I'm definitely going to bring in at least three heavy choppers here, guys. Because that was just absolutely terrible here. We faced all that damage. I'm not even sure if it stats there, but the good on him there. He has just crushed me. So let's go back. We know we, we've lost that, unfortunately. Um, did we grab enough end rooms to get the chest? I'm not sure. I think we needed four more. And we might have grabbed only three. I'm not too sure there. Let's see what's happening here. Come on, those low health bombardiers die. We don't have any rocks on that side, so that's terrible. Those guys are going to have no issues over, over there. These guys, they might have some issues there. They do have a shock launcher here and a crew launcher. Yeah, so it's really that side that's really going to um, help him over here. 
So he knows he's already won. He's probably not collecting for uh, chest there since he has retreated. That's fine. I'm thankful that he's just ending the match there. Let's go back and see is that enough to grab this chest back down there and no guys we have to do one more here so i will go ahead get one more if we grab the win over here against this guy i might just retreat um depending on if he fizzled out and presses the retreat button there let's go over here another um base let's see so let's bring in three over here play it safe until we have that uh troop health there Drop all these guys down. And come on, troop health. We literally have all the nodes unlocked. Let's go. So take out the boom mines there. And let's see what do we have to do. Okay, this is a bit awkward over here. Let's go. Let's keep to the left hand side, I think. Let's take out those boom mines there. Come on. Okay, so that's fine. And we will do a reef there here in a second. Let's go. Okay. One bomb deer has gone over the boom mine. And let's come over here. Let's flare onto this guy. That should bring them over to the left here. That's fine. And I don't want to use too much GB than I have to here. You can see right there, guys, we're getting hit from the side. So I'm going to reflare over here. Get the heavies out in front. Kavan, don't die here. Let's do a shock over there. We've lost one of our one of our heavy choppers there. And now we should be at a good angle to face this base here. Come on, where's Kavan? Kavan is at the back. That's fine, so long as he can stay there. Okay. We're coming into range of a blaster right there and a clear launcher and a microwave here. So a lot of defense, a lot of prototype defenses this season, guys. Let's do a shock on that clear launcher. I don't want it to slow us down at all. Might have to do a shock on that shock launcher here in a second. Let's do a second window. Okay. Okay, I think we're looking good here, guys. We're pretty much at the halfway point and yeah, we're going to be able to defeat this player nicely. So let's keep going. We have the end room advantage. So let's try and take advantage of that. And clear him as quickly as possible here. Can we flare there? No, we can't. But we can throw out some critters here in a, in a few seconds. Let's throw out critters on this side. Get some damage going. And come on. We've got maxed, um, max barrage here that we cannot use yet. Until these sky shields are down. Let's go. Can we flare? No, we still cannot flare, guys. Keep going over here, and we're already on both the end rooms anyway. So one minute, uh, 30 there, grab the win, just because of the end room advantage there. And one minute 42, what's happening here? Last, he's got two more end rooms here, now one more, okay. And he's flaring, he's flaring, one minute 32 I believe it was, and just about got away with the win, so he must have went all the way around the uh, base there. Phew. Okay, so I'll take any sort of wins I can get, to be honest. Let's go back. How many stars is that? I think we lost 11 stars on the last one, so we really need 11 here to try and get back into it. Yeah, there it is. So there it is, guys. We're going back and forth in rank uh, 22. So let's see what we can unlock here and grab this one. And there it is. Okay, so I'm going to do one more, guys, uh, with that troop health. Just stick with me here. Let me know how far into the tech tree you guys have gotten and what rank you guys have finally reached. I think this season most people have been able to achieve achieve diamond rank, uh, which should be pretty good anyway. Put people in a nice starting position for uh, next warships anyway. So let's see, another base. Okay, so I think we're going to have to... Let's, say, let's check out his stats though, actually. He has 140 building health, 40% building damage. 160% troop health, 250 uh, troop damage, 80% uh, GBE. So building health, he has a lot of building health, but no building damage. So I'm going to, I feel like I'm safe to bring in an, an extra boat of bombardiers here.
drop everybody down and let's go so we're going to be going all the way around the base over here up until that last area over there now is it going to be worth uh barraging at that that sky shield i think it might be because we can actually flare one of those engines there so let's go so we're going to build up some gb here let's take out this guy over here i think we should be able to grab that flare and flare to that engine once we take out the sky shield come on right there okay let's see let's take out the mine right there boom mine Okay, so far those guys are perfectly fine. Let's save up some more GB here. We're looking good. Bombardiers have hit the boom mine there. Should I do a second win? Yeah, I might as well. Bring back the bombardier and a couple of heavies along the way right there. So that's fine. He doesn't even have max rockets here. So I'm pretty happy with this base here. Let's go. Let's do a barrage right there. And I think we might still have to do one more barrage here, guys. So once we get the get the artillery, then, then that'll help us quite a bit here in terms of helping us to take out these sky shields. So we have to do one more here. Come on. 40 GB. That's quite a lot here. 32 GB right there. And the troops don't even need my help right there. We're at the end point here. He's on two of our engines. Wow, okay. Let's do a barrage over here. Come on, barrage. We can, we desperately need to be able to flare here. And we still have not. Wow, okay. So that's uh, not good. Let's do uh, critters over here. Take out these last mines. And we're not going to be able to flare to that last one, unfortunately. So we have to force our way uh, through that entire amount of defenses here so that was unfortunate we basically wasted all of our gb right there trying to take out the sky shield so that's fine woman is 40 is that a competitive time it doesn't seem like it It looks like he took that quite quickly there so i'm not sure what he used let's take a look woman is 46 by six seconds there unfortunately let's see what's happening and three heavy choppers okay he used rock choppers okay yeah rock choppers super fast super fast there did he try to do a flare at the last couple of engines i think he probably did here how did we do at stopping him here guys and uh, nope he simply reflared okay and he's gonna flare back again i think yep there's a reflare right there yeah we simply don't have too many defenses that could take out these air troops right now and he did a ton of barrage right there. Okay, so we definitely would have won that, I think. Okay, he had all that barrage at the very end to flash kill our end doom there, guys. Okay, guys, so that's going to be it from me today. You can see right here, still hovering at rank 22. Fingers crossed we can grab into um, rank 23 by tomorrow. But that's going to be it from me uh, today. Let me know how you guys are going. And don't forget to leave a like and subscribe.